currently leading joke. First, currently trailing 2-0. <laughs> <to zero>. Joke. <laughs> You're like making the jokes my grandfather would make if he was commentating. <laughs> and this will be our <laughs> first match of the day. <laughs> it's not the first match of the day, it's all one of our last ones. As uh, this series is getting closer and closer to ending with Sting currently leading 2-0. And it's also always do that. They're one of the teams that just brings out these guys and no one hears of them. They do well in tournaments. So let's introduce our players then. In the top left, we do have uh, NS Hoso Sting. It's game point for him. Yeah, game point, match point. Going up against his opponent, right, match point. I am LG first. Is he going to make this comeback? He has a lot of support in that uh, IM team. A lot of decent experience, a lot of decent players in there. But one guy is on a roll, is Sting, who's gone through so many players throughout this tournament. Um, and just thinking about just a couple of them, he's gone through Virus, he's gone through FXO JKS, through Empire Vines, through Zenith, through Hyun. Oh, god damn it. And then he went through Slayer's Coco as well, man. It's an Vines. impressive little run. Vines would be the other Protoss that he beat. I'm not sure about um, FXO JKS. JKS. I don't know who that is. But, yeah. but to beat Vines, like, a lot of people actually quit the Zenith argument. Protoss? Is it Zenith San? Is that his name? Yeah. San Zenith? Yeah, right? that's his old name, San Zenith. Protoss, right? He's really good, yes. Yeah. He is Protoss. But uh, once again, we're having a gas opening. Idra hates him, but that's, that doesn't actually... Idra hates everyone, apart yeah, from exactly. us. Apart from us, we are the exception uh, to the We're world. on the very short list. We're on the very short list. One bad move, and we are on the blacklist. Um, Alright, so we do have Sting opening up with gas again. Showing it blindly to his opponent. Could be mind games, could be not. Um, of course, can be, or most likely, um, not going to be a factory this time. I don't think he's going to be a factory. I think it's going to be two barracks. I'm going to call you out. Calling you out? Am I going to be right? What are you calling me out? I think it's going to be two barracks. Not fuck you this time. Oh! Oh, wow. that's... oh! 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 How yeah, did, that's how did right. You share your knowledge of this. Why share my knowledge? Because he's not really playing mind games this time. Well, he is. It's not at the ramp. Is what but it's is. not the ramp. Yeah. yeah. I was going to get to that. At the point. ramp, it reveals it. Yeah. When it's off. You know what's interesting, though, is uh, it's. It's either factory or that, and I wonder how much first we'll read into the mental game of this and be like, okay. Factory is of, is actually more risky too, yeah. which is why you'd have the barracks at the front rather than the back, like this. Ah, very good point. Because this is now more accepting. Still. Okay. Yeah. Because this is more accepting. Because if anything happens, he's like, yippee doo da. I feel like this is a terrible map for two racks. Like. There, it's not a, it's not a small oh, ramp. Double refinery. To the oh, I know what this is going to be. Have you seen this build? What is it? No. It's a uh, very fast medivac off one base. I have seen it. It's I really it's annoying. Terrible. It's really it's bad. But I think that's what's. You know who did this to me? I played. Uh, King. <laughs> I did play him as well, but no. Uh, Maka, Maka did this oh. to me a few times. I think it's really bad. Yeah. I like five gated him and accidentally won. Really? Yeah, I one gate expanded. And I was like, uh, I don't see an expansion, so I guess I'll just add more gateways in the night. Ran up the ramp and killed them. Yeah, this is really frustrating to deal with. I think because you're stuck, you, you're like expecting early pressure, but it's not really early, early pressure. So you kind of hinder yourself a little bit, and then it's like, ah, oh, he's going for stim, he's going for medivac. So uh, this can be difficult, but uh, again, depending on how things go down here, what tech he's going to throw down. Well, it's, it's a cool coin flip too, because like you were saying, I mean, if you do some kind of tech as Protoss, like if you did one gate Robo and got an Immortal or two out, yeah. uh, the fast medivacs can do a lot to punish it. Or if the Protoss is super active in the middle of the map and you drop behind lines and their base, mm. they're in trouble there too. And he's got a small squad making his way across the map here, first of all. Just a handful of Marines and a Marauder. But with the Marauder, it doesn't have concussive shells this time. He's gone straight for Stim. Is he going to commit? I don't think he should commit. He's just stay calm. Just, I know the tower's fine. If he goes further, he could get caught and lose everything. I um, like him taking the tower, though. Yeah. Uh, especially with the, what do you call it, surrounding the tower? The shrubbery. The shrubbery? Yeah. <laughs> You can call it the bushes. Yeah, that's what everyone else would call it. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh no, look, it's not going to be Medivac, it's actually going to be a tank, what? which is just as awkward. You know what, I've seen this build too, this is really... This, this is awkward. actually what they used to on like Crossfire and stuff. Yeah, yeah, oh god, Crossfire there, it's good god. Here? I mean, I guess, uh, I don't know, I'm kind of looking at the uh, map. I guess it could be okay yeah, if it was hugging, like, uh, like Hotbit. Yeah, you don't know what to look at, but the 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 ledge, the ledge like left and north a little bit of the pylon that's just finished on the natural. I think that's actually a nice yeah. little place, but we'll see. 
Um, we're at Star Pot's coming down as well, so I guess that's just going to be for single medivacs to help this out too. Uh, but this is a very powerful push. What does our Protoss have? Two gateways, a third gateway, and a robo. So three gate. We actually got a very good amount of probes. Forty probes. Good God, that's a lot of probes. And he doesn't really know if this is all all in or not. He doesn't know if there's a base or not. I think we're gonna see a Protoss win. I think. Uh, yeah. And you know what? I think the sad part about this, and I, I'm gonna put myself out of the line here and make one of those judgments that a caster shouldn't because yeah. it's too much of a commitment. It's better to be completely vague and ambiguous so that you're never looking wrong. Yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> I, I think it's just naturally going to get defeated. Like, I don't think uh, there's going to be any particular light bulb. Or it just works or... down. I think he's just going to have an immortal and then a colossus come out, yeah. and he's going to accidentally kill this. He should build a yeah. robotic bay. He doesn't. He doesn't know it's all in because he's got. He's at forty six probes. If he, oh. if he knew it was if he knew it was one base, he would have stopped at like thirty thirty five. So he doesn't know it's an all in. So two forge changes things, man. If he still kills us, then I'll be surprised to myself. But really. Two forge... Because well, you're yeah. saving up gas, ready for it, and well, it just doesn't help. It's, yeah, it's yeah. 300 minerals at least. Why away. isn't he bringing every single SCV with him? God damn it! Is he bringing any? Is no, no, any? none. Let's oh, see. two. Oh well. Okay. None that basically. Oh, three. There's a third. And <laughs> uh, now this is coming. The can the forges are cancelled immediately. Oh, that's good. At least he caught that. Yeah. And uh, do you hold off here? I don't know. It's hard. Well, good mm. force goes. Too big of a chunk of force. Oh, oh my god, god, too big of a chunk of force. Don't want. Do not want. Oh my god, this is ugly. Yeah, he's. Uh... The immortal's almost out. If he can get the immortal out, maybe, but this is really difficult. He's got so many probes. A big stim, though. Orange health. And these guys are going to die fast. Great save on the probes. Wait for the immortal. Wait for another round of units. Yeah, he can't get down that ramp. The, the tanks reach it. Yeah. He'll, the tank should be able to The immortal has to go first, and then. The well, Marines and Marauders can target it then. They're gonna, have a ah. concave. they're gonna have a concave around that. It just doesn't matter. This position's too powerful for the Terran. Is it over? Yeah, it's over. And Is Sting gonna win 3 0? Yep. The probes ah. are trapped out there. That's a lot of probes. He didn't even get the. Oh, back. wait, 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 wait. He does get down there. It's gonna focus down the Immortal, though. Without the Immortal, the oh. Stalkers are made of glass. He's gonna depower those two gateways. Watch this. No, don't watch this. Totally should have done that, but he decided not to. Fix them. Uh. One immortal, four stalkers. Ah. This sucks. That sucks to go out like this. Yeah. Yeah, 3 0. Sting's gonna pick up this victory, man. Hey, congrats to Sting, though. We got a Terran player in the TSL. They were, yeah, 3 0. Uh, I bet the Team Liquid staff was breathing a sigh of relief because they're looking at who qualified and they're like, oh god. <laughs> what if it's all Protoss and Zerg? <laughs> All right, so Sting is gonna do it, man. He's gonna do it, and this is great. This is absolutely fantastic news here. And five stalkers, though. Sting is going to be a Terran player qualified. Even though we had a Terran player finish second place, uh, Select finished yesterday in second place. Yeah. Sting is actually going to close up the 3-0 of his opponent, and an unlikelihood of two finalists here. Sting and firsts. Um, but you know, Sting's done it, man. Congratulations to NSO. So he's now raining down the damage. Still has all his SCVs at home, and it looks like this TSL qualifier is about to end. He's warping in his last set of units, or trying to. Yeah. Right now, with three medivacs with Stim. Unfortunately, doesn't have combat shield, but with a third tank coming, absolutely no way, Jose. That's someone else we're sending them to. Here's the probes. Now, in this best of five, it would appear that I am first. We'll take second. Oh, you 